Hello, this is Robin Ellsworth with Tridea Partners, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to customize your workspace in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. In this video, I will show you how you can customize the navigation pane buttons and hide or display the favorites pane or the navigation pane. I have AX 2012 open on my screen. Here is the navigation pane. Within the navigation pane are the favorites pane. Depending on which functional area you are in, the navigation pane will show an expandable list of all the areas within the module and the shortcut buttons. You can resize the navigation pane by hovering over the side of the navigation pane until the cursor becomes a double-sided arrow and then drag accordingly to resize. You can also minimize the navigation pane by clicking the Auto Hide Navigation button. You may want to rearrange the order that the navigation buttons are arranged in to put your most used functional area buttons at the top or arrange them in alphabetical order as I like to do. Let's look at how to customize the navigation pane buttons. First, expand the File menu, select View, and select Navigation Pane Options. Alternately, you can use the shortcut button at the bottom of the navigation pane area. Click the chevron button to see more options and then select navigation pane options. In the navigation pane options form, select which buttons you would like to display by checking or unchecking the box next to each shortcut button. To change the order in which the buttons are displayed, select a shortcut button and use the up, down, top, or bottom arrows to reorder the shortcut buttons as desired. To reset the order of the shortcut buttons to the default order, click Reset. When you are happy with the arrangement of the shortcut buttons, click OK. The changes are saved automatically. Now the buttons appear as ordered in the navigation pane and in the breadcrumb bar above. Next, let's take a look at how to show or hide elements on your workspace. Click the File menu and select View. You can choose whether to show favorites in the navigation pane or show the navigation pane by selecting or deselecting the checkbox next to each option. The settings are saved automatically. Let's choose to hide the navigation pane by clicking next to the option to deselect it. Now the navigation pane is no longer available and we must go back to the view menu if we would like to change the navigation pane setting back. Click File and View. Click to the left of navigation pane to change the setting back. On the view menu, you can also choose to auto hide the navigation pane. Let's select this option. The navigation pane will collapse automatically if you click outside of the navigation pane area. It will show if you hover over the favorites area or the navigation pane area. Undo the auto hide navigation option by following the same steps. I hope that you have enjoyed this video on how to customize your workspace in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and check out the Tridea Partners website for additional information. Thank you.